Bumpity, bumpity, bump. See, look, it's the same word, just with different endings. Look, bump, itty, bump, itty, and then plain old bump. Story by Carol Parker. Illustrations by Lyle McDill. Bumpity, bumpity, bump. What do we see here? I see one, two people in the car. And I don't know, is that a person? And then it looks like this is a very friendly bear. Gee, I wonder what this story is about. Let's see. Bumpity. Bumpity bump. The back door flies up. No one notices. Wow. Out flies the yellow straw hat. No one notices. Hmm. I think these people should be paying more attention, don't you? Except the cow. <laughs> Doesn't that look silly? Well, that cow has a straw hat on. That's pretty silly. My goodness. The swimming tube flies out. No one notices. Oh, I have a feeling there's something silly on the next page. Let's see. Just the duck. Out flies the beach towel. No one notices. Except the horse. Look, the horse is wearing the beach towel. Next goes the teddy bear. No one notices. Uh-oh, what's going to happen? <gasps> but the baby! <gasps> Look at the baby as a teddy bear. How wonderful. Spotty jumps out. Oh, no. And everyone notices. Ready? On this page, it says you could write a story about what the characters who got the stuff did. So, like, you could write a story about the duck in his inner tube. Or you could bring a beach towel outside and sit and read. Oh, I love that idea, especially with some of the weather we've been having. Or you can create sand art pictures or make a design in a jar with colored sand or create some illustrations like these. You see, these illustrations are special illustrations. They're made out of paper in a type of art called a collage. So you glue paper together and it makes a different shape. You could read a book about firefighting as a career. Do you see? Spot is in the fire truck. Or you could study water or fire safety because of the inner tube and Spotty ending up in the fire truck. How fun, isn't it? That was a very fun book. So, thanks for reading this one with me. I hope you've had a wonderful day. Take care.